you have spoken uh, your piece about your AEW departure on social media. You were pretty clear about that. But I am interested yeah. in how you landed in AEW because I know that their approach to signing people was different than a lot of people expected. They wanted fresh faces like yourself who were on the, the global level as far as in-ring and performance and character but hadn't quite got that exposure. So how, how did that work? How did you come into the fold? Yeah, it's kind of a funny story because I would have never guessed they would have even been interested. Um, I think I had just moved back up to Chicago within a year and had mm -hmm. started grad school. And that's when I um, was really pursuing wrestling like full time, like 100%. I was in, I was like, I'm giving this my two years of graduate school to pursue wrestling full time. And I don't, I don't know if I knew what I wanted, but I think I just wanted to like live off of wrestling, sure. like income, if that makes sense. And yeah, it just seemed like everything was starting to happen so fast because it was like, okay, Japan broke my collarbone, came back. <laughs> then um, like, I think like won the AAW Women's Championship or something. And then like, was it from this? So that I just got a message from Britt Baker one day and just asked if I'd ever be like, or just asked like what my goals were in wrestling and like what I, where I saw myself in a few years. And I remember like thinking like, oh, that's a fun question. I'm like, oh yeah, like this and that. Like, um, and then, you know, she came back with like, oh, would you ever be interested in like, you know, a contract with any, you know, I'm just like, Oh my gosh, like, yeah, like, who wouldn't be? You know, that's why we do this. And um, she's like, How about with AEW? And I was like, Oh my. And I was like, My heart like dropped. I was like, Oh, do you like have their contact information? Do you know who I can talk to? <laughs> yes, I'm like 100%. I was like, I would love to, like, even just like to be, I don't know. I was just, I don't know what I was just, I was just trying to get anything. Like, I was like, Oh, I would love to. Like, I was at um, their first show in Chicago at the Sears Center. So, and like, just seeing that, like, I remember like being in there and I had the broken collarbones. So I had my mm -hmm. sling on and I'm sitting there and I'm just like crying because I'm like seeing like, um, you know, the girls like Britt and like Tessa and Chelsea. And I was like, cry it was just like so happy and it was cool. And, like, um, so yeah, to be considered for that uh, was awesome because I was just in Japan with Britt a couple weeks earlier. And then once, you know, we talked a little bit, she was like, okay, I'll get you in contact with brandy if that's okay she's gonna be reaching out to you and then when i talked to brandy i remember like <laughs> i was trying to be so like <laughs> calm on the phone but inside i'm like sh i'm like shaking and i'm like sweating because i'm like i like i had when i first got on the call with you i was like yeah i'm like really socially awkward <laughs> <laughs> um so like imagine that conversation and just trying to keep it cool and not say like anything you know that will get yeah. me fired before I even started that for this. Um, so yeah, after that phone call, like it went well. And like, I think at least, cause then I, uh, yeah, I, like we went to the the press conference. There was an, like, I still wasn't believing it. Like we're yeah. taught in wrestling, like, oh, you, you get this pipe dream and blah, blah, blah. And like, here's this brass ring. ring and um, yeah, so it's very much like a, I'll believe it when I see it type of business. But I of was- course like happy to even be considered like I was yeah it was amazing so did that come that seemed like it came together pretty quick did you did yeah. all this happen like before they officially announced AEW or after because they announced it on New Year's Day it was like at midnight New Year's Day oh my gosh why am I even blanking yeah but it was, I but I know that they told Brit don't sign anywhere after all in it was, yeah it was after they already announced it Okay. I mean, because I had already knew, yeah. Yeah. I if I, I could be wrong, but I'm guessing, like, logically, sure. if he had asked me about a specific company and I knew of them, then yes, that's, yeah, because I think it was, like, September that I had been contacted yeah. about it. 